what's going on guys this is boot ramp playing boom beach so people have been requesting for this setup it's gonna be all heavies for me to attack with it's gonna be super awesome to see if uh, the all heavies can uh, take down the real player base um i'm gonna be taking out um i'm gonna be testing out the all heavies on a unboosted up base maxed up and of course a boosted up base maxed up so this is the heavies guys i got like eight landing crafts and i can i can carry like six heavies on each landing craft so well, let's scout the map. What do we have here with Fat Frank, Willie? Okay, a uh, real player there. I think we're actually gonna be starting with um, Fat Frank. I like that name actually. Fat Frank's awesome name. Okay, this is Fat Frank's base, and from what I see here, it's offensive. It's offensive base. You do not have any uh, ice masterpieces here, so that means it's gonna be easy for me to take out the uh, the defensive uh, buildings on his map. So I'm gonna be start working out on the shock launchers, and I'm gonna be taking that shock launcher out. Both of the shock launchers are now down, and I still have 58 gunboat energy. Um, when you're using this kind of troops, use all of the uh, the gunboat energy you have before you deploy your troops, because uh, it doesn't cost anything for the heavies to be taken out. It's only the tanks. So let's take out the heavies. Let's see how powerful this combo actually is. Uh, there's a lot of HP on this heavies, and it takes a lot of gun power to take down one heavy, guys. I think it's like two shots from the boom cannon, and probably like four shots from the cannon. And they also can handle one boom mine damage. So, okay. We're working on the base. And from what I see here, it's actually monster damage on the heavies, guys. It's actually super awesome damage on the heavies. They're taking down buildings surrounding the HQ. Totally insane. And check this out. They're not suffering any damage at all from the rocket launchers. Because the rocket launchers are actually doing really low damage. It's actually really, really, really low. Same with the machine gun. It doesn't hurt the the, uh, the heavies. Only the boom cannons and the cannons are actually doing the mass damage on the heavies. But check this out, guys. It's a maxed up player base, and I'm pretty much taking it all down. Fat Frank, Fat Frank is actually going down, yo. He's actually going down, and I actually love this. But remember, guys, have in mind this is an unboosted up base. That means it's easier for any kind of combo actually to take down bases like this. Um, for boosted up base, it's gonna be harder. So, yes, that's what that was the first base we attacked, and now we're gonna be attacking a boosted up base, guys. And let's check this guy out. Okay, this is Willie. 1373 medals. It's a boosted up base on the guacamole, guys. Of the guacamole, it's like five eye statues boosted up. I think this, this is gonna be totally insane. Even the rocket launchers are gonna do mad damage against the heavies because they're because because the ice crystals are boosted up. It's gonna be insane, guys. It's gonna be insane. So let's work on the shock launcher. And as you see here, the shock launcher can actually handle a lot more damage uh, rather than the unboosted up base. So I need to take down the shock launcher behind there. Oh my dang it, that's two barrages on that second shock launcher, and I struggle, I struggle to take it down. So I'm going to be deploying on my troops because I basically need gunboat energy to shock the boom cannon and cannon. Oh man, oh man, that's so fail. I need to retreat this attack. I need to retreat it, guys. I shock the cannon and the sniper tower. I would ra rather shock the, sh uh, the boom cannon instead. Okay. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh my god. Okay, working on the first shock launcher again. And there we go. And I'm going to be tossing two barrages on that shock launcher there. Mm, look at this guys, look at this. The shock launchers got too much HP, yo. It's really hard to take him down. So let's hope I can shock. There we go, I shocked the boom cannon. It doesn't really matter, guys. It doesn't really matter. The cannons are firing me. I'm not gonna be shocking the cannon. I'm just gonna let it fire on my heavies. And the shock, oh my god, the, the, the boom cannon is... Well, okay, I shocked it there. Perfect. Okay, the main problem now is actually the shock launcher behind there. That's going to be a major problem, guys. I do not know if I can take down this base because all of the uh, buildings out there on this base got tons of HP. Tons of HP and the heavies are doing really low damage. We're, we're going to be checking this out, guys. I really do wonder if I can take out this base right now. Woo! Okay. Wow, look at the rocket launcher, guys. It... T it Wow, they're taking so much damage, guys. So much damage. Okay, gonna be working on this boom cannon. So this big guns. 
Oh my god, it's gonna take out all of my heavy CO. This is gonna be really, really hard. I have a bad feeling. I have a bad feeling here, guys. I have a really bad feeling. I do not think the heavies, all heavies, are gonna be able to destroy a base that is boosted up so much like this. I have no idea, guys. And I really do not think I'm gonna be taking down this base. It takes too much time to take the, uh, the buildings around the HQ. HP is too vast, guys. It's too big for me to take down. So basically, destroyed my army of heavies all heavies guys it just went down it's still a lot of defensive structure on this base and it's just not possible all heavies so from what we see here guys uh attack with all heavies on our unboosted up base is totally totally easy but attacking a boosted up base is way much harder so this basically it guys i really hope you guys enjoyed this video 